Hey guys, welcome back to another video. I haven't posted a new video regarding the happenings in uh, Verdansk in a little while, but this is just too odd not to show you guys. Now, if you didn't know this already, one of the things I explained in an earlier video at the time the Vodianoi crashed into Verdansk is that I believe the entire Verdansk would be progressively overrun by zombies. I also explained why at the time I already believed the newly opened nuclear missile silos would possibly be the nukes launched upon Verdansk itself as the only solution to eradicate the infection. So far I've been pretty spot on. One of the most interesting things to date for me was the explanation of the Vodianoi. I get goosebumps still just thinking about it. Now if you've not seen that video yet, I highly recommend you watch the entire video. I'll put the link up in the card over here. So do yourself a favor and go check it out. Okay, so as predicted, the infection is spreading. Initially it was the Vodianoi wreck that was the only zombie point of interest. Then the event activation terminal disappeared from there as the zombies spread to prison. From prison, they've spread to hospital. It seems to me like the zombies at hospital have also become stronger. I mean, we now also find EMP zombies, ones with blue eyes as opposed to white eyes. Anyway, we're still heading towards the eventual destruction of Verdansk. In many of my last videos, I've emphasized that another possibility is that Verdansk may not be completely wiped off the face of Warzone, but it is possible that it may be changed by the apocalyptic event on the horizon. A nuclear event could reshape and change the face of Verdansk so drastically that we could end up with a new map and a new name for it. However, it has been made pretty clear on Activision's side that it will be destroyed. I'm still curious as to what the new map will look like though, despite all the speculation going around. Now, what this video is mainly about and what I'd like to show you guys is this. A player with IGN Pro Reborn has had an interesting experience inside a hut near a TV station. This hut had to be opened by code in the past, but at this time it is always unlocked. Apparently if you stand and look at the Verdansk map inside there for long enough, explosions will occur over the map, covering it in black. This is believed to be symbolic of Verdansk's destruction. Then, shortly after, the room will somewhat fill with gas. The gas had no effect on the player at all. Now I don't know how this happened because I myself happen to have been there in Plunder, Battle Royale Quads and Battle Royale Solos and I saw nothing happen. But the footage doesn't lie, does it? Well guys, that's a wrap. That's all I wanted to show you guys. Thank you for watching. Please remember to show your support by hitting the subscribe and like buttons. If you don't mind, drop a comment and let me know what you think. Furthermore, for those who have not yet joined our social platforms, please check out the description below for everything from Intel, cool content, free gaming wallpapers, free games, gaming codes, you name it. Right guys, stay frosty.